right there. Hey, 131, my, my son's got some problems there with the, uh, with the Star Wars game. I'm back wide. What's the problem there? Exactly what's the problem there? You asked to help me play my game. Got to help you play the game? Yeah. All right, I got to help my son play his game, man. He's got a problem with the Star Wars game, so I got to do a pause for the cause. I've been on this radio for too long anyway, man. It's been almost 20 minutes, man. I've been on this radio, so I can get off this mall. 131, Mojave Desert Radio with my Dave Maid. 250%, look at that. Yeah, I thought 280%. Holy mackerel. Yeah, I get about a 300 and I start pinching that carrier. You, hear, you, you heard that click, 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 click? That, that's the carrier shutting off. <laughs> 250 percent, I get about the 280 percent, I start shutting off the carrier. And I start shutting off my transmitter. So you hear that click, 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 click. 131, getting down. Sounds like you need to go help that doggone young man down there. 131, get away from that radio and help your boy. Audio man is gone. Out, man. He just said he just figured it on out. You know what's going on. That one, two, three, he just said he just figured it on out. He ran, um, he ran out of my radio room. He ran out of the radio shack right now. He said, I figured it on out. He's playing that Star Wars game right now, man. He can't quite figure out what's going on with me, man. He sees he's looking at me. He sees me with a soldered iron. He sees me working on radios late at night. He sees me with his oscilloscope going. He don't know what the heck I'm doing, man. He can't figure it out. He likes it when we go motorcycle riding, but he can't figure it out when I'm talking on the radio, man. I'm trying to, I'm, I'm trying to keep the next generation, the next generation of mall droppers going. <laughs> That's a goal, man. I'm trying to get my son and my daughter to be the next generation of mall droppers, man. We see if we can do that. <laughs> but I don't know if I can be successful. Come on. I think you better do your best. I think you better do your best to get him up in the radio. Ain't no doubt in my mind. We got to keep them generations going. Hey, 131, audio oh, man is gone. One, two, three. Yeah, man, that's what I'm trying to do out here, man. Same thing. I got them going, man. I've got them. I have a couple, uh, couple of radios over here, man, where they can break on in on uh, on 11 meters, so they can sit back and uh, talk back in the world of sound, man. See if I can get them up. Uh, yeah, just a wee bit interested, man. Just a wee bit interested in what they're going on out here. Yeah, RF technology. I'm gonna get a little, a little kit there, man, where they can start wiring things up, make lights going. They can make little things going, man. Get a little circuit kit. Oh, holy mackerel, man! They make a little bit of a, a little AM receiver. A little bit older, man. My son's only five. My daughter's only seven, man. They're, they, I tell you what, man, they're awesome on motorcycles, but when it comes to electronics, man, it, it's a little tougher, man, trying to make them interested. <laughs> but um, they like it, man. I like all these, these radios, man. I got these little uh, little radios, yeah, the little Motorola radios, man, 30 megahertz. They, they work about uh, 30 megahertz. I got them set up uh, at 30.1000 megahertz, little Motorola HTs, man. And yeah, we ride motorcycles, man. I'm trying to get them interested in radios. They got to move that frequency down to the uh, 26 megahertz band. We'll see what that happens. <laughs> but I appreciate them flowers, man. You sounding good out here in the world of sound. Most of them. Hopefully I'm making a little bit of noise out there and I can keep up by the big boys. If I don't live to key down time, thanks to Dave Maid. One three one in the desert, break the break. 